don't know how many of you are familiar with machine learning. Uh, probably some of you know it very well. But I thought we could really talk a little bit more about the technology for a few minutes, you know, to make sure that we are um, having a, a playing, uh, level playing field here. So machine learning is a subset of AI, and AI has been around for decades. In its simplest form, think about machine learning as a set of algorithms that are learnings from millions of examples or millions of data sets. And as it does, the computer gets better and better at recognizing very complex patterns out of data, out of text, out of video, out of images. That's the simplest form. If you think about Google Photo, some of you are using Google Photo, it's using machine learning. If you're thinking about Google Assistant, it's using machine learning. Why? Why? To recognize your voice, to really understand you know, the, the, the meaning of your sentence. There are three reasons why machine learning is happening just right now. The no number one is the availability of an exponential increase in power that is following Moore's law of doubling every about 16 to 18 months. In reality, it's really important to understand these graphic processing units, which have been sold, sold by Intel, by NVIDIA, by Google, which are allowing or enabling the type of massive parallel processing that is being used by machine learning. The number two thing which is really important to understand is the abundance of data. The fact that we have massive data sets available because of the internet, because you all are using your smartphone, is really important for machine learning. Machine learning doesn't really work without data. And last but not least, which is the secret sauce, is the availability or the evolution of neural networks. That's a little bit of the geeky part here. What is a neural network? So think about it. Think about your brain. It's millions of little computing units that are interconnected with each other and organized by layers. And the neural networks, that it, as it learns, is adapting the weights of the algorithm during the learning phase. And once it has learned, a large neural networks can really understand very complex patterns much, much better than any other human being on Earth.